كانت في الأجل زياش في الاستلام زياش في العمقة دي ممتازة وحكيمي جول وحكيمي جول حكيمي جول أول أهداف المنتخب المغربي نعم أحلى تمريرة منك يا زياش لاسيس غير ماذا تفعل ياسين غلطة كبيرة غلطة كبيرة تساوي هدف التعادل مشاهدينا الكرام او ما فوطا يستغل خطأ فادح هنا في خروج الحارس ياسين بولو هدف مقابل هدف مشاهدي جزاء لفائدة المنتخب المغربي يوسف العربي اوقع المدافع في المحضور نعم سنتابع لهذا مرة اخرى سيان ما حصل في الدقائق الماضية زياش وزياش وزياش والهدف الثاني نعم هدف ثاني عن طريق زياش يصنع هدف ويسجل هدف وهو الهدف الخامس عشر من سفيان مرابط هنا الدورة القيادية كل زياش وهذه فرصة فرصة يا برقش على الأرجح يمشي لتنفيذ الركنية وزياش وقول فعل نعم ثاني اهداف زياش والثالث للمنتخب المغربي بي. شوف واستمتع شوف واستمتع الريش اليسرى الساحره من زياش زياش نفذ الركنيه حطها له حكيم ثم بعد ذلك باليسرى بوم تسخر في الشباك ثلاث اهداف قل وبرقوق دي فرصه قل جديد نعم من اول لمسه ومن اول فرصه يتمكن من افتتاح عداد الاهداف مع المنتخب المغربي اهلا بحلولك يا زكريا يا ابو خلال اهلا بانضمامك يا ابو خلال رفقه المنتخب المغربي ايمن برقوق وزياش زياش يوزع الكرات يمينا و... السلام عليكم ساكر راكنز وات ا جريت جيم اجينست سنترال افريكان ريبابليك ذير واز سو ماتش that I saw and that we have to talk about right now. You just witnessed the goals that I provided uh, at the beginning of this video. So as you saw, there was so much happening and um, I want to talk about the three tops and the three flops of this game. But before I start, subscribe to this channel. Thank you very much Shukran Bazef for your support. Let's go. All right, let's get it out of the way. Let's start with the flops. Flop number one. Ashraf Hakimi is injured. Wish him all the best, like Shafi. Bad news for the national team, but also for Inter uh, Milan. So uh, I hope he gets well very soon and I hope it's not a serious injury. Flop number two. What a bad day of the goalkeeper. That might happen. He is a current European champion and he has so many great games and helped the team out so many times before but today he messed it up a little bit made some bad decisions came out of the goal uh for no specific reason i don't know why caused the goal in the beginning number two uh he in my opinion caused the penalty which uh w wasn't a penalty uh, after all in my opinion, it was a clear penalty. We were very lucky. What is your opinion? Put in the comment section below. Do you agree with me? Flop number three. Uh, don't judge a game by its result. <laughs> I don't know if that's a real statement, but you know what I'm talking about. Uh, of course, it's a high result and a very clear result. But in my opinion, um, as I said in previous videos, never underestimate the smaller African teams. And in my opinion, that was a very, very tough opponent. Uh, we were very lucky. First of all, there was a penalty uh, which was not given to them. Secondly, uh, we were oh, we were struggling in the defense, in my opinion. And Central African Republic could have scored one or two more goals, and then it would have been a very, very close game. That is a very nice test for the next and the future African champion. But you know what I'm talking about. The defense wasn't that clear. There were two or three players with a weak performance, in my opinion. Uh, definitely Sufian uh, Mrabit, not good at all. Barkhoch, even though I'm a fan, 
didn't see that much of him and uh, yeah, the goalkeeper as I said, but it happens. You know me, my name is Yusuf, I'm a soccer rockin. This is Soccer Rocko, your favorite football channel. It's a positive channel, so we're jumping right in. Let's turn to the three tops. First of all, what a great performance of Hakim Ziyech today. Great assists, great goals, uh, as well as uh, Ashraf Hakimi before, before he was injured. Great performances of uh, tons of players. Secondly, um, a very great and high result, which helps us keep that confidence up and that self-esteem, that team spirit up that we need to uh, on our road to the uh, AFCON. So let's keep it up. Um, and thirdly, huge fan of AZ Alkmaar, as you know, and Bukhlel, Abukhlel, Zakaria Abukhlel. He scored his goals, he just came uh, uh, on the pitch. Um, with his first two or three minutes for the Moroccan national team, scored his first goal. Mabrok, welcome to the national team. Bienvenue. Uh, yeah, gefeliciteerd, as the Dutch people would say. Yeah, as you saw, you saw it all. If you didn't see that game, then, um, just check out the goals in the beginning again. Uh, my analysis, I hope you disagree, uh, because if you disagree, put it in the comment section below. If you agree, you can write down in the comment section below. Yusuf, you're the man, you know everything. I appreciate it. And do not forget to subscribe because there's so much happening. There's another qualification game uh, on uh, November 17th. So I'm gonna be there inshallah with another video. You don't wanna miss it. Just let that subscription button explode. Click the bell. Shukran bazaf. Ma'asalama. Leon. Goodbye.